Shalom, my name is Yeshua Yaakov, and this video is uh, being made from Jerusalem uh, to comment on uh, the Jewish Agency speech by uh, Prime Minister Olmert. Uh, specifically, um, let's see, the first thing and probably the most important thing is we have to all get on the same page. Uh, we're told uh, there's a new paradigm. Well, let's uh, be specific, the, the word is misused. Uh, what the Prime Minister was talking about is dividing up the pie, the responsible, who gives what, who gets what, who spends what, da 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 da, da. The most important um, event in the last uh, century uh, is the collapse of the local reality. It impacts and impinges. Oops, I'm sorry, here I am talking away and I don't have on my head here. I'm Yoshua Yako. I'm a didactic scientist from Jerusalem and I'm starting all over again at uh, one minute and three seconds. Um, it, the comment is on Olmert's um, Jewish uh, Board of Governors. Uh, uh, first and foremost, a few corrections. One, the largest concentration of Jews uh, in the world is not Israel. It's North America by an order of about 700,000, 800,000. Don't believe or trust uh, the demographics that are uh, the propaganda spin that's coming out of Jerusalem, Aleph and Bet. Uh, let us be clear, anyone who is thinking that there is going to be uh, a leadership and uh, uh, the new paradigm, the new paradigm is, uh, is misused. The word paradigm means an entirely new system. And indeed, there is a paradigm shift, and that paradigm shift is the result of the collapse of local reality. It began 18 years ago. It came to Israel on November 5th, 1995, with the murder of Rabin that collapsed the local reality. And what was the local reality? At that time, it was Zionism. All denials notwithstanding, that's the page we're all on. But there's a problem. With the end of man and mankind's exile, which is the result of the collapse of the local reality, we're supposed to be in the quantum reality, which is redemption. We're not. Israel's denial is blocking it. And as long as Claudius so blocks it, it's blocked for all of man and mankind. Having said that, we have to end the denial to inhabit the quantum reality. And this is the reality. This is the most important information for a world jury. The second thing is the leader of Israel. Uh, who is the leader of the Jewish people? Uh, we're told that the head of the nation state of Israel because it's the, it's the center of Jewish life. It is not. The center of Jewish life uh, is uh, the people of Israel um, and, uh, and, uh, and, the, and firstly the Torah and secondly the people of Israel. And the framework in which we understand leadership, there are two uh, attributes or two characteristics uh, that, that devolve from the time of Moshe Rabbeinu that define the leader of Israel. Uh, the one closest to God and the one who is the leader of the Rove, which is the largest Jewish community. The largest Jewish community in the world is North America. And uh, the, uh, the leader of Israel it, again, is the one closest to the one who is the, the leader of the rove and, uh, and the, the one who is closest to God. That's Yeshua Yaakov, uh, the one who is speaking to you. Now, for the reasons beyond this uh, um, video, uh, that's, uh, that's a subject for another day. In the meantime, I'm the author of Human Ops, the Trilogy. It is the post-collapse of the local east-west convergence model. It's comprised of two paradigms. It's central organizing principles, the first receive it to give. This is the Holocaust of redemption for the religious, and for the secular, it is the new cognitive behavioral science first principle, uh, with which we ascend from behavioral mammal to cognitive being, and we inhabit the quantum reality, which is receive it to give. What is receiving to give and what does it replace? Receiving to give means receiving the authentic you to give the authentic you to the authentic you, to your children, to your family, your community, your nation, all mankind. And giving to receive is the old paradigm that collapsed. Uh, and that was, that was giving to receive means I give, I get. And uh, that's finished. That's not coming back, folks. And so that is where we are, and we all have to get on the same page, and when we do, we'll end the denial. And when we end the denial, we will deconstruct the collapsed local reality, which is ground zero. And that operates on four levels, on the psychosocial, the behavioral, the cognitive, and the psycholinguistic level, and that means in reverse order. 
the individual family community and national national levels okay so that is where we are now that we're on the same page now that we understand what uh, is uh, is going on uh, we can uh, then begin to undertake the uh, probably the most important project in the history of uh, the Jewish people which is uh, really the uh, the ascent of, uh, of man and mankind. It's Israel's, uh, it's Israel's place and position to lead. And, uh, and right now, we're doing just the opposite. We're in denial of the collapse of the Lord. The end of man and man's, we deny it. The collapse of the Lord, we're in denial. When we end that denial, again, we're going to de deconstruct, the program, restore and heal. Okay, so that is the task before us and the framework in which we do this is human access and human access for programs, of which I'm the author as well as the four paradigms, those are subjects uh, for another and more detailed briefing, another video. Uh, but this is the most important message for the Jewish community. And the most important, I think, um, uh, perspective is that uh, this is the new central organizing principle of the Jewish people, as well as of all mankind. Human economics in general and its central organizing principle, receive it to give. Receiving what? I repeat, receiving the authentic you to give the authentic you to who to you to the authentic you to your children to your family to your community and to your nation and to all mankind and this is where we are today and this is the uh, this is the absolute imperative of uh, of, uh, of what is before us what we're to do as uh, as, as a nation as as people and in perspective oh, we are wasting our time if we are expecting um, the uh, the the princes of Israel to to do this. They're they're just not capable of this. Uh, they're well intended. They're good and decent decent people. But Ehud Olmert and uh, Zippy Livnay and Shimon Perez and uh, and so on. Shal Mofaz and uh, this one and that one and that one and Bibi. They're going to happen. Okay, so uh, this is where we are. This is what we have to do. And so I thank you for listening. I'm Yeshua Yaakov. Uh, this video is made from Jerusalem. I'm a didactic scientist. I was born, uh, my father was a, an anthropological humanist, and my mother a traditional spiritualist. I was born Michael O'Donnell. Uh, <laughs> you, uh, you combine those two uh, with the mother uh, who had Jewish roots, and as an adult, uh, I returned to my uh, my people and our tradition. And I'm Yoshua Yaakov, and I live in Jerusalem for the past 22 years. Again, I'm the author of Human Monks, the trilogy, about 2,500 pages, a few hundred graphics will be published on the web over the next year, year and a half, uh, because there's a there's a bunch of legal issues that have to be solved regarding the intellectual property. But having said that, be a few hundred graphics as well. In the meantime, we continue the work with the, uh, the videos, and I thank you for listening. I'm a didactic scientist, and we thank you and wish you from Jerusalem blessings and Kabel B'Shvilatet.